what is the equation of the horizontal line through the point negative four comma six? So let's just visualize this. Once you get the hang of it, you might not have to draw a graph. But for explanatory purposes, it might be useful. So negative four comma six, that's gonna be in the second quadrant. So if this is my x-axis, that is my y-axis. Let's see, I'm gonna go negative four in the x direction. So one, two, three, four. Negative four, and then one, two, three, four, five, six in the y direction. So the point that we care about is going to be right over there, negative four, comma six. And they're saying, what is the equation of the horizontal line? It is a horizontal line. So it's just gonna go straight left, right like this. That is what the line would actually look like. So what is that equation? Well, for any x, y is going to be equal to six. This is the equation y is equal to six. Doesn't matter what x you input here, you're gonna get y equals six. It just stays constant right over there. So the equation is y is equal to six. Let's do another one of these. So here we are asked, what is the slope of the line y is equal to negative four? So let's visualize it, and then in the future, you might not have to draw it like this. But let's just draw our axes again. X-axis, Y-axis, and the slope of the line Y equals negative four. So for whatever X you have, Y is gonna be negative four. Let's say that's negative four right over there. And so the line is Y, the line is Y equals negative four. So I can draw it like this. So what's the slope of that? Well, slope is change in y for a given change in x. And here, no matter what I change my x, y doesn't change. It stays at negative four. My change in y over change in x, it doesn't matter what my change in x is. My change in y is always going to be zero, it's constant. So the slope here is going to be equal to zero. Y doesn't change no matter how much you change x. Let's do another one of these. these are, this is fun. All right. So now they are asking us, what is the slope of the line x equals negative three? Well, let me graph that one. So let's again draw my axes real fast. X axis, y axis, x is equal to negative three. So negative one, negative two, negative three. And so this line is gonna look, let me, is gonna look like this, no matter what y or well, you could say no matter what y is, x is gonna be equal to negative three. So it would look like this. x is equal to negative three. So what's the slope here? Well, it's undefined. A vertical line has an undefined slope. Remember, you wanna do what's your change in y for a change in x? Change in y for a change in x. Well, you could think about what's the slope as you approach this, but once again, that could be, some people would say maybe it's infinite, maybe it's negative infinity, but that's why it's undefined. A vertical line is going to have an undefined slope. So go with undefined. Let's do one more. What is the equation of the vertical line through negative five comma negative two? So let me do this one without even drawing it, and then I'll draw it right after that. So if we're talking about a vertical, if we're talking about a vertical line, that means that x doesn't change. X doesn't change. If we were talking about a horizontal line, then we'd say y doesn't change. So if x doesn't change, that means that x is just going to be equal to some constant value. Well, if it contains the point negative five comma negative two, so if it has the point where x is equal to negative five, and if x never changes, it's a vertical line, well that means this equation has to be x is equal to negative five. And we can draw that out if it helps. So let me draw that out. So, whoops, let me make sure that's a straight line. Okay, so we have x and we have y. And so we have the point negative five comma negative two. So negative one, two, three, four, five, negative one, two. So we wanna go have a vertical line that goes through that point. So a vertical line, well that just goes straight up and down. So it's just gonna look like this. 
And so notice, x never changes. No matter what y is, x is equal to negative five. This has an undefined slope. It is a vertical line. Its equation is x is equal to negative five.